Alright guys, so we're gonna start our own version of the paper roller coaster activity. So I have here some mixture of the templates that I printed out. As you can see, my printer stopped working part way, so we'll make do with that. I got some tape, scissors, and this cardboard piece that I found. And we're gonna be following this beautiful hand-drawn design. So let's go ahead and get started. So I've combined the two papers and I end up with this giant piece here. So when I loop it, it looks like this, which I think gives a better height for a loop. So we'll go attach that now onto the roller coaster itself. All right, so now we've added the loop. Had to add extra supports to hold it up because I think I made the ramp a little too short so it was kind of floating in the air but it's looking good so far let's keep going okay so now i'm gonna make a little hill something that looks like this and i'm gonna add it onto the track all right the hill has been added and to finish it up i'm gonna add one more loop and then it should be done okay so here is the finished product got one loop the hill and the baby loop. So the only problem I have right now is that I only have like these bouncy rubber balls and I definitely think that that's way too thick or too big for that loop. So we're gonna try to see if we can find something else. Okay, so we're gonna try this tomato. There you go. Okay. <laughs> okay, so I was able to find this bead, wooden bead thing that I think will make a pretty good ball. So let's go test it out. Yay! Yay! So let's recap. I learned a couple of lessons while making this roller coaster, paper roller coaster. If you are gonna make a paper roller coaster, make sure you are building it based on the ball that you have and be prepared to kind of have to redesign it if it's not working out. So for me, I had to take out the second loop in order for it to actually finish the track all the way. But aside from that, I think it went pretty well. Anywho, I hope you guys enjoyed that activity and that you learned something new today. Thanks.